friends, I wanted to take a moment to make a video to address some concerns that I have personally found using um, Power E-Trade and hopefully to help uh, help my fellow traders to understand what's going on with this stuff. So without further ado, sometimes uh, E-Trade will not let you open a position. For example, SIF. We're going to try to buy it for $1. We're buying one share by SIF and send. And E-Trade says, opening orders for this security cannot be accepted online at this time. For assistance with placing this order, please contact customer service. So, uh, unfortunately, this is just one of the perks of dealing with E-Trade. And sometimes... Uh, you can't order a security online. It, it makes it, um, leads to some frustrating moments, but that's neither here nor there. When this happens, sometimes it happens in pre-market, and then when the market opens, you're allowed to open orders online. But um, sometimes, for example, with SIF, you just can't place your order online. So that's... Um, that is a sock. Okay, so we are going to do something else. Okay, this is for traders with a cash account. Uh, if you have a margin account, I think that this works differently. But if you have a cash account, you can see here in my position box that I have no positions which is to say I do not have a position in IZEA, but I'm gonna sell it anyway. So a change to sell, one quantity, we're gonna sell it on the bid. Okay, so if you have a margin account, this is how you would short sell. I have a cash account, and uh, the reasons for that are for another video. So I'm going to sell the one share that I don't have. Oh no! Your account has not been enabled for margin, or we are currently reviewing you margin, up, you margin upgrade application. If you have questions, contact customer service. Yeah, so I can't sell shares that I don't have because I have a cash account. And if you see this message, um, it's the same for you. If you were trying to buy and, uh, and you get that message, then just make sure that uh, you have the correct action selected. Okay, uh, so now we're going to do something funky. All right, uh, I'm going to buy one share on the ask. And should go right through, queued, open, filled. There we go. All right, you can see now I have one share on the ask. And now I'm going to buy uh, two shares on the ask, just so we can get filled for the purposes of this presentation. Let's see. Open, filled, boom. Now I have a total of three shares, and I bought one share one way, and I bought two shares another way. So now if I wanna sell one share on the bid, and I click send, and it says, we have selected offsetting lots based on your lot preference of first in, first out. If you would like to select a different lot, please place your trade on the E-Trade website. So uh, the first time that I saw this, I thought I was stuck in a trade, and it was a friggin' disaster. So if you see this message, um, it actually led to my my biggest loss in a long time just because I saw red and I panicked so don't panic uh, it just means that they've selected the first lot that you bought so if you remember I bought one share I am now selling that one share um, and now that the bid has dropped down I'm not gonna get this so let me try again here we go boom send that and you just click send. It's basically just a confirmation screen and everything is fine. Boom, there we go, filled. All right, and just so that I'm not sitting here with two shares of IZEA and definitely wondering what in the heck happened, I'm gonna go ahead and sell the other two shares that I bought.
And you can see it was not a problem because I only had two shares left. I sold all my shares, so I wasn't selling it in separate lots. Um, this is not investment advice. I'm not affiliated with E-Trade, um, blah, 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 except that they're my broker. Although IZEA does look kind of nice here. Let's see how much work they've got to do. Oh, yeah. They got a lot of work to do. I'm, I don't want I don't want to play with that right now. Okay. Well, I hope that this video saves you a lot of trouble and saves you hundreds of dollars as it would have me. And I do bid the adieu and the happiest of trading. Farewell.